This program is for plotting the Mohr circle when a stress tensor is given uh, and S is nothing but sigma, sigma 1, sigma 2, sigma 3. Uh, clear and CLC are used for cleaning this clear screen and work data. Uh, for loop starts i equal to 1. Uh, I think so, I wrote this just to init uh, get into this. This is not required at all. Seriously, it is not required. Let's get into our uh, program. Mm, T is input tensor. The tensor will be in, uh, that uh, three by three matrix tensor will be uh, inputted using this and store and value of T. S is equal to I of T. I of T is nothing but finding the sigma one, sigma two, sigma three. You subtract T minus lambda I is equal to zero and find lambda the three values. S gives the three values. S one, S two, S three. Sims X Y is nothing but you uh, something to initiate x and y i think even that is even not required <laughs> so that's not required mm. let a1 be equal to 0 and a2 is mean of s2 s3 mean of s2 s3 is means that uh, s of 1 is the value given by lambda 1 and s2 is the value given by lambda 2 uh, s3 is the value given by lambda 3, sigma 3 i mean s1 s2 s3 sigma 1 sigma 2 sigma 3 s of 2 s of 3 uh, mean of sigma 2 plus sigma 3 by 2 r1 is sigma 2 minus sigma 3 by 2 uh, these all are taken from the notes seriously uh, formulas are just made uh, c1 c2 c3 uh, r3 mean uh, radius formula uh, s1 minus sigma 1 minus sigma 2 by 2 the mean is just a function which does this thing at mean of a comma b is nothing but a plus b by 2 hope you understand the rest mm, c1 it displays just this as a text c1 of x comma y means this will be your center and this will be the radius this will be your center this will be, radius, this will be your center this will be the radius now click on uh, save it i saved it as more.m uh, you can also plot it using the command plot but i have not yet done after i done i upload it tensor enter the tensor matrix one two three Six, eight, nine, five. Whatever I get, I'm typing. This is the t value which you have entered. This is the sigma one, sigma two, sigma three in the respect ascending order or descending order. Uh, see, this is the center. This is the center. This is the radius. This is the center. This is the radius. This is the center. This is the radius. Uh, I'll tell you how to plot a circle. Hope you will do the rest. Uh, plotting a circle, um, uh, you have to go to polar coordinates where x is equal to r cos theta uh, and r runs from and give the value of radius fixed uh, r is equal to 5 it will store r is equal to 5 uh, you can see here it stood r as 5 everything comes in the alphabet order here over here uh, these capital uh, caps locks are given first preference and then the letters uh, small letters and then the letters with numbers uh, radius is given 5 uh, our theta should be uh, theta should be given let us write th for theta. Theta should be from 0 to 0 0.1 steps, 0 to 5, uh, 0 to 180 degrees, I guess. 0 to 180 in steps of 0 0.1, that's theta. Uh, that's the radius of circle, right? It gives a full, uh, I mean, 360. Or you can write as 2 pi, 2 into pi. Uh, that gives the whole circle. If you write 180, it gives only up to half. So even that depends. If you give from pi to 2 pi, it gives from the lower half of the circle. Um, this will store the values. Leave this everything. If you should have used a semicolon to stop this from printing. Uh, next, give a plot. R comma theta. Shit. What again? Okay, okay. Give a plot. R sin theta. Cross theta. More into cos theta. R into sin theta. There you get a circle. Uh, use this concept uh, 
uh, it's so easy just enter the value radius uh, write the give the angle and write r sin theta r cos theta and that will plot your x and y and finally you are done here is your circle to implement in this in the code and go to the code and go to the editor type plot uh, your radius is r1 uh, r1 r1 into means i guess sine comes cos comes first uh, cos th comma sine th teach is not yet de declared uh, th is equal to theta which runs from 0 to steps of point 0.1 in steps of point 0.1 to into, into pi let's give a semicolon otherwise it will print the result and we don't want that uh, what about a center uh, for giving the center you could have to give r cos theta uh, minus a1 and uh, minus a2 i hope this will plot at least uh, first more circle even i'm not sure this is the first one we enter the uh, tensor you can click up arrow to get your previous answers if there's something wrong okay uh, r1 is not yet described the mistake r1 we will save and run it tensor there you go hope oh, oh, we got our plot also here is our plot uh, our center is at somewhere 0 to come on this uh, if anything is wrong this is the x-axis it is on the x-axis uh, somewhere at the top that means we have we have should give our sign and then cos so that will that kind of things used uh, just reach it uh, watch